Hello guys, this is Elric IT and welcome to this video in which I'll show you how to connect your Cisco router to your real network using GNS3. In this case, I'm using my Ethernet network adapter on my laptop to connect it to my real network. So I'll, I'll be having my modem assigning a uh, dynamic IP address to my Cisco router in GNS3. So let's see what's our current uh, IP range that is on our real network. So I have in here my Ethernet adapter, which I have the 192.168.200.x. So this is a 24-bit mask. I'm I'm currently with the dot nine IP address on my laptop, so I should be getting an IP address from this uh, subnet once my Cisco router is connected to the real network. Let's see how it's done. First, we must get a, a router from, from our router tab. I have uh, four routers here, but I'll be using the 3725 router. So I'll just drag it to the screen, start it, and the next step is to select a cloud. Uh, the cloud object is the one that is going to let us connect uh, our router, uh, one interface of our router to any uh, logical or physical network adapter that we have on our laptop. So let's drag it. I'll be selecting a, a, a server. I'll be choosing the default, which is my PC. So let's uh, drag it here. So in order to to see what are the network adapters that this cloud is available to to have, we have to uh, right click on it, configure, and then show special Ethernet interfaces. We have to check this box and then add all, so we can see all the network adapters that we have. In this case, I'll be using my Ethernet network adapter, so I'll be choosing it. I mean, I don't really have to choose it in here. It's just for allowing this cloud to to assign any of these um, network adapters. So I'll be clicking on apply and OK. Then I'm, I'm going to connect my uh, router one fast Ethernet 0 slash 0 interface to the cloud one and then I'll select the network adapter that I want. In this case it's Ethernet. Okay that, that would be it for now. Let's go in, uh, to the router one console and configure the fast Ethernet zero slash zero interface to get an IP address via DHCP. Let's go console. Let's wait a little so it opens my my console app. So it's it's pretty. Okay, I'll go to conf t and then interface fast internet zero slash zero no shot then IP address DHCP so I should now uh, wait a little like one minute or less and I sh then I should see an IP address assigned to my interface. So it happened faster than expected. We can see uh, that via DHCP, my interface fast Ethernet 0 slash 0 was assigned an IP address which is the uh, 200.12 with a 24 bit mask. As I said, this is the uh, IP subnet that my real network has. So to see that indeed, we have access to to the real network, which uh, in this case I'll be using uh, DNS, uh, Google DNS to test internet connectivity from my router in GNS3. Let's see that indeed it has the connectivity to our real network. Ping 8.8.8.8. Let's see. Okay, it worked. So it worked properly as expected. So as we can see, it is very simple to connect our Cisco router or any other device using GNS3 to our, to our real network. I hope you find this video helpful. helpful. 
if you liked it please subscribe and be be uh, be access uh, have access to more uh, training videos see you next time